What's up guys? Today I've got something super special to share with you guys. So obviously you can see I have a big brown box and this big brown box is full of all kinds of awesome stuff and I've got a very very special and exciting thing to tell you guys about a partnership that I'm going to be doing this year with a company that I really believe in and for a long time use their products and that company is Lose Fishing. So Lose makes all kinds of rods, reels and that kind of stuff but I'm only going to be partnering with them on the reel side of things because obviously I work with G-Rod but I'm going to be using Lose on all my G-Rods this year and I am super super excited. So I've got this big brown box it's full of all kinds of new reels and some other stuff so let's get into this thing. We'll do an unboxing. I'll show you some of the reels that I got and just get into this thing. I'm, I'm really, really excited about this partnership. It's uh, something when they contacted me that, you know, I was really, really excited to work with them on and start really figuring out the details on because, like I said, Lose is a company that I've used their products for a long time. I own, I think, three LFSs. The first reel I ever bought for myself, you know, like with my own money, was a Lose LFS. Uh, I used to crank with an old BB-1. One of the first reels I ever got was a hand-me-down Lose BB-1 that my dad gave me. Um, I've used Lose spinning reels for a long time so I'm just really excited to work with these guys so let's get into this box and see what all I got so I know what I got um because I actually put in the order for all the stuff but still I want to go through them show you what I got and uh, kind of give you an idea of what I'm going to be fishing with this year so first thing I see here is a t-shirt so I got me some lose swag it's always good to have some t-shirts and things like that so you got lose right there on the front on the breast side pocket and you got lose on the back so really cool shirt then they also sent me oh a sun shirt oh i love good sun shirts this thing is wicked and again just like the other one i got lose right there on the breast pocket and then lose on the back as well so this thing will be awesome to wear on those hot summer days when i'm out there deep cranking flipping and frogging and then they sent me another sun shirt in red which is wicked too because i love sun shirts i wear them all of the time when it's hot outside that and a face shield are my two favorite things so really awesome got some apparel to wear which is cool but now let's get into what's really important and that's the reels that are in this box so i'll start with this one right here it's the first one on top and the first one that i see i don't think they're closed up in any way and that is the lose mock spinning reel it's a 6-2 gear ratio spinning reel which is really cool because most of your spinning reels are in a 5-1 gear ratio but this thing is going to be a little bit quicker and i got this thing in the 3000 or the 300 size and here it is so really good looking that's a really clean looking reel really digging that I like that all black, uh, the green accents there. And what's really cool is Lose this year partnered with Wind Grip, and they put Wind Grips on a lot of their reels. So as you guys can see there, that material on that reel handle is a little bit like uh, the material on a golf club. So it makes it really sticky. You can get a good hold on it, be able to crank those fish in. Um, but like I said, matte black with those lime green accents. And that thing is looking pretty. That thing is going to look sick on a G-Rod spinning rod for sure. It's a really good looking reel. I'm going to spool this one up here in just a little while because tomorrow I'm going to need this bad boy for what I'm going to be doing. And it's a little bit of finesse fishing on a local lake. So the Mach 2 Speed Spin. There's the spinning reel that I got. And that's actually the only spinning reel that I got at this moment just because I don't use a spinning reel a whole lot. Um, and most of my finesse applications are going to be able to be covered with this one reel and just, you know, switch among them. If I get in a situation where I need more than one, I'll just have to cut off and retie, and I think I'll be good, though. Um, so the next thing I see here is the Lose, uh, Team Lose Custom Pro Speed Spool L or SLP, and this one is in the 7 5 to 1 gear ratio. So this reel right here, is a 
a uh, pretty expensive reel and one that I can't wait to use. This is actually going to be the most expensive reel that I will own. Um, but this thing is absolutely sick. It has the wing grips. It's got the gray coloring to it with the black accents. Like I said, 7-5 gear ratio in this one. And I actually ended up getting two of these. Um, one for my small body cranks and then one for my jig rod. And this thing has just a little bit shallower spool than some of the other reels out there. But nonetheless, it's going to be pretty sick. And something I've re been really digging along with the wind grips that they put on here is it's got this little thing right here. And you can flip it out. And that is actually, let's see, you can probably see it better that way. That little thing is actually a bait keeper. So that little thing right there is a bait keeper. So you can hook your frog or your Texas rig or whatever you want to to it. And then when you're done, you just flip it right back down and it goes back into the reel. But this thing is super duper light. If I'm not mistaken, it is only 5.6 ounces. It's got the super low profile aluminum frame and a carbon fiber drag system. And then it has a 27 position braking system and a double anodized Dura aluminum U-shaped spool. And like I said, carbon side plates, which that is what makes it so light. And you're hitting that 5.6 ounce range. So like I said, I've got two of those. Um, here's the other one. I won't get it out of the box, but it's in the 6-8-1 gear ratio. And I'm going to use it for small body cranks. And like I said, this thing is going to be used on my 7.5 foot um, G-Rod Pro Bass, my favorite rod that I own just for a little bit of everything, Texas rigs, jigs, all that kind of stuff. So super excited to put those both to good use. Now the next one is something that I've been looking forward to and I think it's going to be a really cool reel to use all year and I got this one in the 6-8 gear ratio as well and this is going to be a reel that is very affordable for the price point that it's at and you're getting a lot of tech in this reel um, for the price point that it's at and that is the custom speed spool L SLP. That SLP just keeps throwing me. This one too is going to come with the wind grips. It's going to come with the 27 point uh, position braking system. It's going to come with 10 ball bearings, super low profile aluminum frame, all the same tech, but just at a better price point. And I got this one to throw on my spinnerbait rod. So this one's really cool. It's got the white with the gray and black accents. Again, you got those wind grips on the side. And this one also comes with the little bait keeper as well. You can flip it in and flip it out. Really cool reel. I can't wait to throw this one a lot. I like the 6.8 when it comes to chatterbaits, spinnerbaits, those kinds of things. That way, because I'm kind of fast when I fish. I'll find myself fishing a little bit too fast. So when I've got that slower gear ratio, I don't fish those baits too fast and I can get those bites. And then two, I just like this wide. I think it's going to pair up really good um, along with the G-Rod that I'm going to pair it with. So really, really cool looking reel. The whole braking system on the side or your spool tension knob, there's a lot to that and I'm really not sure about all of it right now. I'm going to have to really look into it and figure it all out. But when I get it figured out, I'll make sure to do a more detailed review for you guys and tell you all about it. Um, but here, I'll pop the side plate off one of these things. So here is the side plate off. It has a magnetic braking system in there. And then here, I'll take the spool out of this one so you guys can see it as well. And there is the spool out of that one. And like I said, guys, I, you guys are going to be seeing these things a lot more. This is all I'm going to be using this year. Um, so any questions or comments that you guys got, I'm going to make sure and know the answers to them so that you guys can get the information to, that you need about these reels. Um, but I still got a lot of learning to do about these new lose reels as well. Um, but like I said, that is the custom speed spool, not to be mistaken with the custom pro speed spool. All right, so the next reel I got here is this one right here is going to be my baby, I'm pretty sure, pretty soon. And this one is one that I'm going to be using for my swim baits and my A rigs. And a lot of you guys probably already know what that is. And that is the Lose Speed Spool Super Duty Wide Edition. And I got this thing in the 6 8 gear ratio. That way I'm not too fast, but I'm not too slow with that 5 1. And I'm going to have plenty of torque to get those fish out of there. Like I said, it comes with that extra wide spool so you can spool up that heavy braid or that heavy uh, copolymer or fluorocarbon. Comes with the big 100 millimeter sweeped power handle with the big foam grips on the side. 
This thing has beefed up bearings, beefed up gears. Everything about this reel is just bigger and badder than the normal speed spool or any reel in the loose line. And this thing is going to be an absolute killer on a big swim bait rod. And I cannot wait to toss some big swim baits with it. So really looking forward to using this one. Like I said, Super Duty is a reel that a lot of people know about. It actually comes in a regular spool size too. And it is great for frogging and flipping. But I got a reel other than the Super Duty for that application. Then that is the two reels left in this box. And these right here are kind of loose uh, reel that they're known for. The BB-1 has been around for a long, long time. I actually deep crank with a BB-1, so I didn't actually get a deep cranking reel because I already have one. And like I said, I've used a BB-1 for a long time. And my buddy Ben Nowak is a BB-1 lover himself. So I asked him, I was like, hey dude, if I was gonna get a couple BB-1 Pros, would you suggest get them? And he said, absolutely. So I got two in the same exact gear ratio, um, the seven five to one, and I got one for frogging and one for flipping. And we'll crack one of these bad boys open so you can see this thing. And here it is, and it is exactly what I expected. It comes with the 100 millimeter sweeped power handle as well with the foam grips. It's got a little bit deeper spool just to accommodate a little bit bigger line or more braid. That's why I've got it for frogging and for flipping, especially for frogging, I'll be able to make those good long casts. It has the beefed up gears and the beefed up components just like the Super Duty, but not as extreme as the Super Duty does. It again too comes with the 27 position braking system on the side and it's just a super, super duper reel and I cannot wait to throw these things on my flipping and frogging setup and go out there and absolutely whack some fish in the face with it. And that's it. That's what I got in this order. Um, I am super, super appreciative of Lou's for bringing me on, giving me a chance to use their products and promote their products through my channel. I know that you guys are out there that you love, you know, a lot of you guys really love Lou's products. You talk very highly of them. Um, and like I said, I've been using Lou's for a long time and I'm excited to work with them this year. So as always, guys, Thank you for watching. Any questions or comments, go leave them in the comment section down below. I'll be down there trying to answer any questions you guys got about these reels. Like I said, I'm going to learn as much about them as I can, get to know them really good so that I can answer all your guys' questions. Make sure to also, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Go check out some more of my videos. I really appreciate it. Go down in the description. I'll have every one of the reels linked so you guys can check them out. You can check out the prices, check out the specs more in detail than what I covered here, and maybe pick up one or two if you guys want to do that. But as always, you guys are sweet, and thank you for watching.